my head. Should I go around like this? Or in front no, of it, like this? <laughs> Sorry. I'm Sam Mewis, and this is my story. In 2016, I was one of the alternates at the Olympics, and before I was asked to play that role, I didn't fully understand what it meant to be a good teammate and what it meant to really be a part of the national team and be playing for something that's so much bigger than yourself. And it took that experience where it wasn't about me and it wasn't about showing Jill that I was good or showing the world that I should have been on the team. It was really about me being at practice and being what the other girls needed. The girls had some extra time after training and instead of taking reps away and doing some shooting, Sonnet and I were just helping recycle balls and shagging balls for some of the girls to do shots. And I think that that's like necessary and I think it was so needed at the time and I'm so grateful now that I had that opportunity to be an alternate and really learn what it means to have to be selfless and have to contribute to the greater cause rather than just kind of being there showcasing yourself. I think I've been able to kind of take that lesson through the past couple years with the national team. I find that I'm at my best when I am very external and connecting with other people and in that sense serving the team is serving myself because it is the easiest way for me to play well and feel like I'm contributing. I think that the most fulfilling part about being here is sharing it and whether that's with my teammates or my family, it's not just me, it's really about everyone and I'm just so honored that I get to be here and I get to share it with people I love. I have this memory of my dad and all the sacrifices that he made, and my mom, of course, for my sister and I when we were growing up. And playing club soccer for Christy and I was so expensive. And my dad really wanted to be able to support us doing that and wanted to give us every opportunity possible. So he used to get up at like four in the morning and work this side job. He used to just like fall asleep on the couch at seven o'clock at night because he was getting up at four every day. I don't think I fully understood it at the time, but when I think back on him making that sacrifice and wanting success for my sister and I, and it wasn't really for him, it was for us, and it was so much bigger than himself. It's not just that I wanna be a good teammate and be here for my team and serve them, I also wanna represent my family and make them proud and make all the sacrifices that they made worth it.